fireproof so that stood up really well um, I can't say the same for my canister filter um, suffered some serious burns um, clearly it started uh, electrically yeah this has happened again I won't be replacing the thermometer again um, if I can get this working, which I'm not sure about, because the actual one of the clips got seriously damaged. And I'm not sure whether it's going to close well enough to stop the unit from leaking. But um, if I can get it working, I'm going to be putting this plug in. Um, where the heater goes. So, although the damage is quite significant, it is only to one side of the canister filter. Um, the other three sides are still well intact. Um, so I'm hoping I can still get this to work. Okay, after cleaning the um, canister filter, there's a good point and bad point. Okay, the bad point is basically, the, I think there's a fundamental problem with the design of the thermometer and heater into the um, filter. Uh, clearly there's not enough uh, water circulation around the heater to avoid it getting up to a temperature that would basically make uh, the glass crack. The good point is that the fundamental design of the canister filter with a outer casing and an inner casing has meant that even though one of the handles is burnt to, well, I won't use the word, um, the filter still runs and uh, I mean I'll have a look tomorrow but at the moment it doesn't look as though it's um, leaking um, but as uh, I mean tomorrow will be the true tell um, okay that's it for this one as to the tank just have a quick look. Uh, tank is actually fine there's no adverse problems it's night time at the moment, so all the corals are asleep. Uh, 